Hello everybody, welcome back. Today is a massive Costco haul as you guys can see. I've probably put the price in the title. Consider yourselves from the future because you are because I have no idea how much I'm how much I'm about to spend in here. I know it's going to be close to $1000 maybe over. I have only started coming to Costco every other month now, so bi-monthly, and we have a lot of stuff we need to get. I've got a baby in the back who needs me, so let's head in. Look at these mums, $17. They are huge. I can't even explain to you how big they are. I'm definitely grabbing a couple of these for the house. I just think how fun. These are way cheaper than I've ever seen in a nursery. I love this pink color. I might do, ooh, which ones do I do? Do I do white or pink? So my strategy with this Costco haul is I'm getting all of our dry stuff first because we have so many things on the list. I'm going to check out, bring it all to the car, and then I'm gonna come back for the chicken and like things that can go bad refrigerated products. I grabbed my fall mums. I got white and pink. They have them like multicolored. You guys, these are huge. They're massive. So I grabbed two of them. I have no idea where I'm putting them, but I am gonna grab a bag of these hippies. Sissy loves these. I don't really know how much they are because they don't have a sign up, but they're usually somewhere around like five, six bucks. Also grabbing a box of these. We have run out of a bunch of our snack stuff. The kids love these. Yeah, she's like, hello, me please. $12.59 for 28 of them. They've got pretty good ingredients. They do contain natural flavors, but balance. I wish we could have made it here last week because these were on sale for $3 off, but we're here now. So I'm gonna grab two of these granola minis. These are by far my kids' favorite snacks. They always choose these. We get in the car and they go, do you have granola? <laughs> And I haven't for the past good while, so we're gonna grab a couple of those. I think these are interesting. These are the bombs, like dark chocolate bombs. They have nuts on them, all kinds of good stuff, like a fun little chocolate square. Those are $10, but they're going away. These ones I'm seeing though, and I'm super interested. Dark chocolate keto nuggets with coconut, pumpkin, quinoa, and sunflower seeds. I think we'll do one of those because that's a good little treat. I'm also gonna grab a bag of these Unreal um, chocolate coconut minis. We keep these in the fridge and then whenever the kids need like a little snack, not really snack, but like a treat, these are tiny, they're a little mini size and these are perfect. Definitely going to grab a bag of these. I've never seen these here ever in all the places we've lived. These are called Sweet Thin, so I'm assuming they're kind of like graham crackers. They're by Simple Mills, great ingredients. Of course, their ingredients are just this list right here, but it does contain cashew and coconut. $8.89, we're definitely grabbing a bag of those. Not something we will be getting, but look at these pumpkin spice yogurt pretzels. If you're into anything pumpkin, you probably will like those. We opened a bag of these, which I know is like a big no-no for some of you guys, but honestly, you guys, let me tell you a secret. It doesn't matter if you're gonna pay for it. It's ours already, so they're very good. I just wanted to tell you that because we ended up getting three more bags. Of course, you know I'm getting our favorite marinara sauce. This is the Rouse, Rails, whatever. $11.99 for two, great deal for that specific brand. These ones are also here, so we're gonna give them the old college try again. We've had them before, didn't love them, but we're gonna try because they're an even better price, $10.89, and they're organic, which I love. So hopefully we like them. We're always grabbing some of these olives. These guys are $16 for two of them. Massive jars. I know it's hard to see, like tell in here because there's nothing to really compare it to because it's all Costco sized, but trust me, they're a great deal. Definitely need some mayonnaise. We have loved this one from Primal. It's the one with avocado oil, but it's just got really great ingredients here on the back. Pretty good price too, because that's a pretty big jar and it's $8.99. Also going to grab two of these salsas. I grabbed one last time. Why am I not picking from the top? I grabbed one last time and Derek ran out. These are his favorite salsa out of anything, even refrigerated ones. He likes these. It's great because they're shelf stable too and great ingredients. They're just the Kirkland brand. Um, $8.99 for those guys. Oh my gosh, you guys, I can't believe I just stumbled upon this. They're actually giving out like Caesar salad today for their trial. Um, and they had this dressing on it. This Primal Kitchen dressing is great. It does contain eggs and coconut, but if you're not sensitive to that, it is, I brought a Caesar salad for camping. That was like my thing that I brought and everybody loved it and asked me to make another one. And it was with this dressing. So. $9.89. I'm actually going to get two of them just because if you make a large salad, so I was making a salad for like, I don't know, what was it? 15 people. So I used a whole bottle of this because with the croutons and the Parmesan cheese for them, it just took a whole bottle. So I'm going to grab some of these guys. Great to keep on the shelf too. 
diced tomatoes are on the list and suddenly they don't have their Kirkland brand. They just have this Tuturoso right here, which is a bummer because they're not organic, but um, I have heard good things about this brand, $6.79. So we'll grab a thing of these and these just live in my food storage and then I'm able to shop my pantry whenever I need them. We happen to be almost out of apple cider vinegar. $8.99 for three of them. I mean, come on, that's such a great price. You have to use it often enough though to make it worth it. I do a lot of pickled things, so I use this pretty often, but it's also great for some kind of like home remedies and face masks and all kinds of stuff. So I use my cast iron, that's my only pan, and then I have a pot and I use this spray avocado oil on it because it's expeller pressed, it's no bad ingredients, Chosen Foods is a great brand, $12.99. So for two of these, great price you guys way better. It's a bigger size than you can get in the regular grocery store and a better price. So I'm actually going to grab two of them because I usually like to have some on hand and I'm completely out in my food storage. I know this stuff is like not the greatest for you, but I like not having to keep a bunch of things of chicken stock on hand. So organic better than the bouillon paste. It gives some great flavor. So I'm grabbing a chicken one and then a beef one as well. They're $8 here, but it's also a larger jar. Again, better price than you can get in the store. It's usually like $6 for a tiny one. Look, black beans, organic black beans. I need to get into making and like sprouting our own beans, but I have a little bit much on my plate. So canned beans it is, but these ones, I'm actually gonna grab two because we ran out this last time, are $7.50 for eight of them and they're organic. So we tried the cherries this last time and they were good, the kids loved them. We're gonna try the organic dried blueberries this time. See if they like them just as much. This cherry juice looks like it's on its way out. This is actually a source of natural melatonin. So if you are having a hard time sleeping at night, obviously talk to your doctor first, but um, natural remedies say that drinking a glass of cherry juice actually helps. I'm gonna grab a box of these. Usually I just go for the plain applesauce. One, it's cheaper, um, but my kids seem to prefer it. But sometimes we need something to switch things up. These are the apple strawberry spinach and apple mango yellow carrot peach. So. We'll grab a box of these guys and slide them right on under there. What do you think? Are we filling up? <laughs> Look at this thing. My kids usually love something called the bear snacks that we get here, but I didn't see them in here this time. These are called the fruit thief. They're little like fruit roll-ups. So we're going to try them this time because the ingredients are actually pretty darn good. There's 20 of them in there for $10. This is where the major like bulk size-wise is going to come from. I need two of these paper towels. We ran out last time with just one. So... I need two of these and then I also need toilet paper. I am going to grab a pack of these Breathe Right strips. These guys are actually on sale right now for $15.99, which again, great deal. Um, these we sometimes wear at night so that it just basically opens your nose up. There's no drugs to it or anything like that, but it just helps you sleep if you get like a congested nose at night. But let me show you this cart before we check out with this first one. We grabbed two of the big fall mums in here, two of these paper towels. We have a cherry juice, some layered fruit bars, that's it bars, the breathe right strips for your nose, these little fruit roll up things, the unreal chocolate bars, we grabbed three of these little um, like honey graham crackers and they're so good. As you can see under here, we grabbed a ton of the marinara sauce. I think like what, five of those and then one of the Victoria Organic. We just do a lot of pasta, but we also do pizza and meatball subs, whatever. Um, mayo, these are like some little chocolate clusters. Two things of black beans, diced tomatoes, um, fruit and veggie pouches. I guess we're getting another one of these. I think she pulled that off the shelf. Down here, you can see we have the granola. I have two of those. Those are the other bags of the honey graham crackers. We have two things of these Caesar dressings, some hippies right back here, and then some dried blueberries. Now we're gonna grab some diapers and then we'll be back in for our refrigerated haul. We're back in for round two and I know this is technically like, you know, dry goods, not refrigerated, but I didn't get to come through the front last time. So $10 for these guys, they're on sale. I feel like even if you use like, a powered toothbrush. These are great to have on hand for guests. Oh my goodness, I just hit jackpot with all these organizers. So I am building my pantry right now, which there will be a video coming out on my entire pantry build. But I have been looking for these OXO cereal ones because you can put other things in there, not just cereal. Like you could put like crackers, little pretzels, things like that. 
So I actually grabbed three of these. They're going away, but this is a way better price. So online, I could find three of them for 55. So two for under 25 is a great deal. Um, I'll just return whatever I don't need. Like if I don't need a pack, that's fine, but I'd rather have it and then return it. And then these I was thinking about grabbing too because I love these. I have a bunch of the iDesign stuff and I love it. $15, you get two of these and it's packet organizers. Isn't that a fabulous idea? I love that in the drawer one. So we're gonna get one of these. And then I also grabbed, I'm not sure if I'm keeping this or not. This is the nine piece container set. I might just try and find these individually. I'm not sure if I'd use all of these like separate little tiny ones. And I want a really cohesive look. So I might put this one back. This one is $70 for nine of them, but I feel like, I feel like that's similar pricing to what you can find at TJ Maxx, but at TJ Maxx, you could actually choose like which ones you like. I don't know that I've ever seen avocados go on sale. $5. Oh, that one's open. Um, we're definitely grabbing a couple of these. So when they go ripe, all you do is stick them in the fridge and then they'll stay at that ripeness for quite a while. But I've been eating avocados every day and loving it. It's a great health, healthy fat to keep you full longer, but you can also add them into smoothies and stuff. Makes it a little bit creamier and you really don't taste it. So we grabbed some organic dates. Love these guys. We love filling them with peanut butter and mini chocolate chips and then freezing them. She's asking for them right now, um, but you have to pit them first. Some organic brown mushrooms. You know the deal with going into the cold section. It's just so cold, I gotta get in and out of there. Broccoli, we've grabbed some asparagus right here, some mini peppers, because I did see they have a dip that we love, and I love dipping veggies in dip. Some carrots, I'm hoping to get some hummus as well to dip, because I love carrots and hummus. Some green grapes. They had some figs. I've never eaten figs, so if you have an idea on how to eat figs, tell us. I just wanted to try them because I thought they'd be fun. Some peaches right there. Um, we grabbed some spinach and two things of bananas down there. So they had these huge blueberries. So fun. I love when fruit comes into season like that. And some strawberries down there too. I am not the biggest ground beef lover, but I think it's a good thing to have on hand, especially if you have an extra freezer. These guys are organic um, ground beef for 25 bucks for three of them definitely need some of that. This is a new ground turkey for us. It's like open. That's so interesting. Anyway, we're going to grab probably at least four of these guys. I love to put them in the freezer. They're a pound and a half each. So I find that it goes a little further. So usually I can add extra things. Like if it calls for a can of beans, I had two cans of beans and this whole thing. And I can usually stretch the recipe to make it into a freezer meal too. You know the deal. If we're getting turkey, we're also grabbing chicken. I'm going to grab at least two of these, maybe even three because I ran out this last time. And these are just so quick and easy to have on hand. We're just looking through to see what the best date is. Just for fun, we're also gonna do one of these organic chicken tenderloins. It's been a long time since we've done that. This is the dip I was talking about. You guys know we love pretty much anything from Good Foods. I love when they have their stuff here. This buffalo style dip is all plant-based, but also all good ingredients. Just because it's plant-based doesn't mean it's good for you. $7.79, no, so much cheaper here, and it's so good. Dip those. Um, hippies puffs in there or carrots or the little peppers love it i made some homemade pickles the other day and they're so good but they are the spears and i love having these to top on burgers or sandwiches just really easy and simple 5.99 these are the grillos pickles if you still have not tried them you are sleeping on them we've been eating these for years and they finally came into costco for such a better price and they are so good so crisp and refreshing they totally moved these tortillas on me. I'm so glad they're still carrying them. We just finished. I usually actually keep a bunch of these in the freezer and I just finished them because I made some extra freezer meals with enchiladas. So we're actually gonna grab several of these. Two is definitely not enough. There's 20 in here, which is great because I can usually double a recipe out of that or at least one and a half of these, something like that. But $11.89, they're, if you have like a corn allergy or something, these are so expensive at the store, but so much cheaper here. We have successfully spent enough on these almond flour tortillas, so I'm gonna grab some cheese. Um, they make great quesadillas too. If you have tried these and you're like not too sure about them, make sure you heat them up in a pan first, otherwise they're gonna be waxy. But as soon as you heat them up for like 15 seconds on each side, they're perfect. So let's grab some cheese. This one, wait, what? Oh yeah, it comes with two bags. These just must be taken apart. We're also gonna grab some of this organic string cheese right here. This guy is $8.49 for, what is this, 24 of them in here? Yep, 24. 
I'm also gonna grab a box of these organic hummus single serves or whatever, $6.99. The only thing I don't like about them is they have organic sunflower oil in them, but they're the best option of everything here. Part two of our final cart. We have blueberries, dates, two things of mushrooms, like seven things of these almond flour tortillas, organic hummus, some organic string cheese down there, asparagus, broccoli, mini peppers. Oh my goodness. Some buffalo style dip, fresh figs, peaches, toothbrushes, two things of these little packet organizers that I showed you from iDesign, um, some shredded cheese. We have some carrots down here, two things of avocados, some Grillo's pickles. We have three of these like pop top cereal dispensers, which I'm really excited about. A ton of meat down here. We have like six of these turkeys, three of the chickens, one of the chicken tenderloins, and one of the beef. And then of course we have some bananas stuck in right under here too. And I know there's some strawberries back there somewhere. Anyways, we're headed to go check out you guys. I hope you have a great day. Thank you for following along. If you made it this far, make sure you leave a comment down below. I want to chat with you guys. I love seeing your comments come through. I pray that the Lord blesses you and we'll see you later. Bye.